A father is still missing in Elk River tonight after he went into the Mississippi River to rescue his children from the water. Fox 9's Bab Santos is in Sherburne County monitoring the ongoing search. There he joins us live now with the latest. Babs? Yeah, we've been here all day and we're really seeing this search just bring this community together, even if at a time of grief. So many people coming here today alongside the river to check in, ask if there have been any updates to see if this missing man had been found. Even seeing some neighbors who told us yesterday they were out on this river themselves with their own personal boats to try to see if they could find the man themselves. It's just really sad. I mean, he... He basically was going to save his two children, and it sounds like it's going to prove uh, costly for him. Sheriff deputies spent the day on the Mississippi River Saturday, the second day of their search near Elk River for a missing father who went under while saving his son and daughter who were struggling against the strong current of a swollen Mississippi River. He's a hero. I mean, he's absolutely a hero. I mean, I, I, my heart breaks for him. Witnesses say the dad, son, and daughter were playing on this sandbar, the kids swimming, when both children began to struggle against the flow of the river just before noon Friday. Their dad was able to pull his daughter onto land, but when he went back in for his son, witnesses say he lifted the boy up and immediately dropped under himself, sending his son floating alone down the river and leaving his daughter all alone on shore. She started to wave her arms and say, help, help. Marianne Jackson lives on the water and watched terrified from her backyard. Oh, I feel so bad. It was just awful. I mean, I, I was shaking by the time this whole thing was over because this poor little child, there she was watching her dad, watching her brother. These photos after show the canoe that Marianne says brought the family to the sandbar. Elk River Mayor John Dietz. The chief told me that he believes there's all kinds of debris under the water and that it would be easy to get stuck down into that or get stuck in that. This weekend, Elk River's mayor also credits Elk River Fire Captain Joe Labor for tossing a rope out into the water to rescue that boy who actually continued to float down the river towards this bridge after his father had gone underwater. They say that firefighter was able to get him out tonight. Both of those children were rescued from the water, but their father remains missing. Live in Elk River, Bab Santos, Fox 9.